Let's take this one step at a time and dissect it. If we are being completely honest, the most recent trend is that the price of Ripple's XRP is not exhibiting much increase despite the fact that the overall cryptocurrency market is making progress. It is very clear that there is something that is preventing growth. Warning this is the long-running legal case of Ripple versus the Securities and Exchange Commission. Don't be alarmed, however, because the Chief Executive Officer of Ripple has come to our aid and provided an explanation of the matter. You are not prepared for the great surge that is coming to our favorite cryptocurrency, and you cannot afford to miss it. Everything will be decided in the near future, but you are not ready for it. First things first, without further ado, let's get right down to business. Disclaimer, as the Securities and Exchange Commission CC and Ripple prepare for the next stage of their legal struggle, it is critical to have a solid understanding of the core of their disagreement. From the most fundamental level, the Securities and Exchange Commission SE asserts that Ripple's sale of XRP constitutes an unregistered securities offering, which is in violation of federal securities laws. This argument, on the other hand, is hotly contested by Ripple, which contends that XRP is a cryptocurrency and not a security. Consequently, there is a sense of eagerness and anticipation surrounding the result. In spite of the difficulties that lie ahead, it is critically important to keep an optimistic view particularly for those who are fans of XRP Ripple. In the words of Brad Garlinghouse, the CEO of Ripple, our primary focus is always on innovation and the development of solutions that are applicable in the real world. In the realm of digital assets, we continue to be dedicated to cooperating with regulatory bodies in order to guarantee transparency and equity. This court struggle took a crucial turn in July 2023 when it was established that XRP functioned as a cryptocurrency rather than a security, this was a significant turning point in the case. As a result of this significant achievement, Ripple and its supporters received a significant boost. By confirming the position of XRP inside the cryptocurrency context, in the midst of the legal intricacies, it is essential to keep in mind that failures can be perceived as chances for personal development. In the words of Jay Clayton, a former chairman of the Securities and Exchange Commission, Regulation should not hinder innovation or this sentiment has a strong resonance with Ripple's ambition of utilizing blockchain technology to revolutionize methods of making payments across international borders. Resilience and drive are two qualities that Ripple continues to exhibit in the face of challenges the company faces. Chris Larson, one of the co-founders of Ripple, previously made the observation that we are invested in this endeavor for the long haul. Our faith in the transforming power of XRP is unshakable Despite the fact that the trip may be plagued with difficulties, both parties will deliver their arguments with vigor and conviction as the remedies phase makes its way through the process. It is crucial, however, to keep in mind the broader consequences of this issue while the legal sparring is going on behind the scenes. Regulatory policies ought to be transparent, foreseeable, and consistent, as Hester Pierce, the Commissioner of the Securities and Exchange Commission, eloquently put it. The question is not just one of enforcement, rather, it is one of encouraging innovation while simultaneously protecting investors. But in the end, when this legal dispute is finally resolved, it will have a significant impact on the future of the Bitcoin sector. As Ripple and the SEC move forward with this crucial phase, it serves as a timely reminder that one must frequently persevere through obstacles in order to make progress. In the words of Winston Churchill, let us continue to have a positive outlook on the future of XRP Ripple and embrace the path that lies ahead with determination and optimism. Now, let's get even farther into the meat and potatoes of the situation. We've broken down the legal conflict in detail, acquired an understanding of the perspectives held by both parties and a comprehension of the significance of regulatory clarity in the cryptocurrency field. However, let's be honest, what are the opinions of the XRP community on this matter? When there is a lot of uncertainty and anxiety in the air, it is simple to get caught up in the language that is being used. Is there anything on the horizon that could be considered positive for Ripple and XRP, despite the fact that there is a lot of legal jargon and regulatory scrutiny? How might we anticipate the outcome of this crucial stage of the legal proceeding? Discovering the prospective outcomes, unraveling the complexities, and exploring the possibilities are all things that we should do. Have faith in me. You simply cannot afford to lose out on this opportunity. In spite of the complex legal situation that Ripple is currently facing with the SEC, the XRP community continues to be unwavering. They are encouraged by a combination of hope, resilience, and possibly even a touch of rebellion. 
Nevertheless, it is not merely a matter of wishful thinking, Jack the Rippler asserts in a tweet that encapsulates the prevalent mindset in a short manner. At the same time as Jack the Rippler adds fuel to the flames with another tweet, speculation is at an all-time high. Not only does Ripple's chief legal officer weigh in with his own tweet, but he also announces the news, presenting a harsh perspective on the recent debacles that the SEC has experienced when it comes to the landscape of cryptocurrencies between innovation and regulation. There is little doubt that the outcome of this litigation will have a significant impact on the regulatory environment for digital assets, which will in turn have an effect on investor sentiment and market dynamics for many years to come. Despite the fact that there is a great deal of ambiguity, one thing is still crystal clear the resiliency of the XRP community. The proponents of XRP continue to be adamant in their confidence that the cryptocurrency has the potential to be a transformative digital asset, despite the legal twists and turns that have occurred. A heartbreaking reminder of the stakes involved and the unwavering spirit of people advocating the cause of XRP, these tweets serve as a melancholy reminder of the saga as it continues to unfold. Nevertheless, despite the fact that the general consensus is without a doubt, what about the viewpoint of those in authority? What are the thoughts of Brad Garlinghouse, the chief executive officer of Ripple, regarding this crucial moment? It is true that we briefly discussed his approach before nonetheless. Providing a more in-depth examination of his perspectives is essential in order to have a thorough knowledge of the scenario. Considering everything, his point of view has the potential to provide extremely helpful insights into the company's strategy and its future trajectory. It is imperative that you do not overlook this point of view. More investigation is in order. The protracted legal struggle between Ripple and the SEC is now taking place. XRP's price has been on a roller coaster ride with both peaks and corrections occurring throughout the course of its existence. Despite the increased volatility, Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse continues to have a positive outlook regarding the capacity of XRP to generate value, even in the face of increased regulatory scrutiny. In an interview that took place not too long ago on Bloomberg Live, Garlinghouse stressed the significance of working together with regulatory bodies, drawing attention to Ripple's attempts to collaborate with regulated businesses like his banks. This relationship, in his opinion, is a good factor that significantly influences the performance of XRP. Implying that additional improvement of its value offer may be achieved through regulatory clarity. The similarities between XRP and Bitcoin were also made by Garlinghouse. While acknowledging Bitcoin's dominant position in the cryptocurrency market, he also hinted at the possibility that XRP may solve problems associated with large-scale value transfer. Garlinghouse feels that XRP might experience a big increase in value if Ripple is successful in addressing these difficulties that involve trillions of dollars. During a discussion about the possibility of an exchange-traded fund ETF for XRP, Garlinghouse voiced his approval of the concept, stressing the potential of the ETF to diversify investments and lower risks for investors. His belief is that the introduction of an exchange-traded fund ETF for XRP would not only increase the diversity of the market, but also provide additional options for investors who are looking to gain exposure to digital assets. The XRP community receives a sense of comfort as a result of Garlinghouse's faith in Ripple's fight against the Securities and Exchange Commission. Investors are instilled with confidence as a result of his steadfast faith in Ripple's position and the possibility of a successful outcome, which in turn strengthens sentiment toward XRP. On the other hand, the impending action brought by the SEC puts a shadow of doubt over the future of XRP, 